Hello, I haven't made a YouTube video in a very long time, um, but I got this new diaper bag, and I've had a lot of people asking me about it, so I'm going to make a quick YouTube video and um, show this diaper bag off. It's the um, Jujube Be Light by Tokidoki um, collaboration, and it's a lot bigger than it looks. It's like a medium-sized tote bag. <coughs> Excuse me. And, um, the straps, I think, are about 10 and a half, 11 inches long. It's got a place where you can attach a messenger strap, which I'm going to do. Um, it's got the logo on the front. It's machine washable, so you can toss it in the washing machine, um, just hang it up to dry. Um, it's just a zipper pull. It's really cute. There we go. I like the zipper pull, it's cute. Doesn't have a whole lot of pockets. That's like my main beef with the bag. Does not have a whole lot of pockets. It's got one zipper pocket on the inside and two insulated long pockets on the outside. And it looks like there's four, but it's made to look like that. These pockets are all the way down to the bottom of the bag. These are deep pockets. And I've got some stuff over here to show you that these pockets, which I typically, um, on this side I have two portable changing pads and in the bottom and this is packed for my six week old in the bottom I have some baggies to put dirty diapers in if I'm out or at someone's house and we have a diaper change um, on this side I just put my phone this side with all the stuff she has the little short um, Tommy Tippy bottles that she uses so it holds that perfectly it doesn't even stick out but I put it on this side and then I put my phone over here um, but let me show you so this is like a typical size Dr. Brown's bottle and I'm trying to do this with one hand but it goes all the way down like it fits perfectly so that gives you some idea of about how big the bag is you got about another three inches to the top after you put the Dr. Brown's bottle. So it's a pretty big diaper bag actually, like for a tote bag. Um, this is a sippy cup and it fits too. All the way down, you can't even see it. And these pockets are insulated, so um, I tested that out today. I warmed a bottle and took it with us and I tested it when we got home, it was still warm. So these pockets work really well. This is the thermos I carry um, warm water in or um, cold formula, either either or, however I want to do it for the day. Um, and it's a Bubba thermos, and it's huge. Hold on just a second. I'm going to put you guys down for just a second. This is going to take both hands, but it does fit. Okay. So it fits like that. So the lid is sticking up on the bubble mug, but it's a huge thermos. So, I mean, it still fits. Plus you can just pull it right out. So it works for me. Um, so I'm gonna show you the inside of it now. It's like hard to unzip with one hand. All right. So inside of this bag, because it doesn't have a whole lot of pockets, I have little extra bags. This is her clothes. This is changes of clothes. She's got, um, and this is just a little makeup bag I got at Walmart, and it was like four bucks. But it's, um, you can see her clothes. She's got a hat and some socks, two pairs of pants, and two shirts in here. So it's a pretty big, um, I can't sit that with one hand. Pretty big case that fits in this bag. So you can kind of gauge how big it is. Um, this is just another little makeup bag. It's a lot smaller than the other one. Kind of see. But this has her pacifiers, her bib, and burp, burp cloths, and um, wash rag just in case we need one, um, stuff like that. And I bought a, um, 
$3 little insert for organizing pocketbooks and things like that. And it fits perfectly into the bottom of this bag. And it's got, as you can see, it just, it's a slide in, slide out. It, it can be its own thing. It actually zips, but um, it's got pockets on the side. It's kind of hard to see. I like that the liner of the bag is bright so that you can see what you're doing. But um, anyway, it's got 13 diapers in it. And then my wife's case is over here on the side. And then we've got her bulb syringe, um, her boudreaux's. Uh, on the other side, I've got some hand and face wipes in this little package here. And then I've got um, her hairbrush. And there's also some lotion in here, a little small bottles of lotion, wherever they are. Second down on the side of this thing. Sometimes you can be too organized. But there, anyway, there's several little small pockets on the side of this thing. And there's little mesh pockets in the front. And they have, um, you can sort of see the little mesh pockets, but that's where the lotion is. They're a little bit further down than the other pockets. But, um, yeah, so she's got all her diaper stuff in here. Changes of clothes, burp cloths, um, her bottles. They go in the front. Thermos goes in the front. This back I use for my stuff. Basically all I carry for me <clears throat> is lip gloss, wallet, and keys. That's it. That's all I need. Um, everything else is basically for the baby. Now, if I have to carry something else... There's still plenty of room. Where's my, there it is. So if I decide to do dry formula and I've got my little container, I can just stick it over on the side and um, the rest of my stuff will still fit. And it will still zip, even with all this stuff in it. Like this bag holds a lot more than it looks like it holds. So. I mean, it's a really nice bag. And they have one called a Super B that's slightly bigger than this. And I would, for me, for the one baby, and we're kind of minimalist, I don't really carry a lot. Now, when she gets a little bit older, when she's a toddler and her clothes are bigger, and she's got to have toys with her and all that kind of thing, then I think, yeah, like the Super B would be a better fit for us because... It's about the size of a large beach bag. Um, it's probably two and a half times bigger than this bag. And it was um, only like $10 more. But I just thought, you know, for right now, this is perfect for us. Um, when she gets bigger and needs toys and bigger clothes, that's a thing that we might look at getting a bigger bag. And I've actually seen bag packing videos where they put this bag inside of the Super B. Pack this one up, put it inside of the bigger bag. And that's not really a bad idea. That way, in case you just want to run in somewhere, you don't have to tote the huge bag. You just got this. And that's mainly why I got this bag. Um, I have a Petunia Pickle Bottom bag. It's a boxy tote. And it's really nice. But even the plain, like, empty, non-packed bag is so heavy and I had a c-section and I was not allowed to lift a whole lot of stuff and I'm still recovering from that because it's only been six weeks and it's just easier for me to have a really light tote and even fully packed this bag is so light like it's ridiculously light so even when I have my thermos and everything in it it's so light so and I really like the print um, it's the Kaju City print. But they have so many different designs. They have Hello Kitty and they have um, the regular Tokidoki with like all the different characters. And But this was my favorite. Um, but yeah, if you're looking for a really light diaper bag, something you can grab um, when you go out to the store with your kid or your baby, 
this is a really good bag. Um, it's not cheap. Um, I got mine for $40 on eBay. And it was brand new. But, um, it depends on what print, what size bag, and things like that. But, for this one, $40 was a really good deal. They usually run about $65. So, um, but yeah, I just wanted to do a little bag video and kind of show it off so that everybody could see it and decide if this was the bag they wanted. Because I know I looked for a long time. And um, the only th there's two things I don't like about it. And that, like I said before, kind of lack of pockets. But that's why I bought that little organizer. And that organizer was like three bucks on eBay. So if you wanted to buy this bag and get the organizer to slide down into the bottom, it comes in all different colors. And with something like this, you could order any color. I like purple. Purple's my color. I like it. So I did purple. And, um, but I mean, it takes up about this much of the inside of the bag on the bottom. The rest of it you can pack out with whatever. Um, some people just pack things in there loose. Um, their clothes loose and things like that. I don't like that. I like being able to reach in, grab a little bag, and if I just, you know, if I need to just go in somewhere and change her clothes, I don't have to take the whole bag with me. Say we're at a restaurant and she spills something all over herself and I gotta change her shirt, or she has an accident in her pants and I just need to, you know, change her real quick. I got her clothes. Um, I don't have to take the whole bag and drag it around with me. But yeah, I just wanted something small that I could take in, like, out to eat or take to the store with us that didn't feel like I was packing to go on a whole day adventure. Um, but this would be fine to actually pack out for a whole entire day, I think, because I don't know anybody right now that their kid goes through more than, and that thing will hold 18 diapers. The, the um, organizer in the bottom will hold 18 diapers. So, I don't know anybody whose kid goes through 18 diapers in the span of six hours. I just, I mean, I could see it because, you know, if they go to the bathroom while you're changing them or something. But, at any rate, I just don't see that happening. Um, I'll put the link to the eBay auctions for where I got the organizer in the bottom of the description at the bottom of the video. My dog's coming to get me because the baby must be fussy. Um, but I'll put that in the description of the video. Um, so in case you do want to get one of these bags and get the organizer at the bottom. And this would be a great not diaper bag too. Um, I plan on toting it with just my things in it afterwards or, you know, whatever. Um, but I really, really like this bag. And I am not disappointed at all. Um, so if you're looking for a, a light diaper bag, you might want to consider the Jujube Be Light bag. Um, thanks for watching.